So hello and happy Easter. So today's topic is going to be on for, um, forgiveness, the importance of forgiving others, and the reason why when you forgive someone, you're releasing yourself from prison or a cage. Um, you may think that you're holding them accountable or you're like you have some power to make them pay for what they did, uh, bitterness, resentment, anger, hurt, all of the above. What has occurred is in the past. You have to leave it there in the past. You cannot drudge it up. You can't relive it, rethink it. Well, they did this and I'm justified because of that. No, no, nope. not at all. You have to forgive. Um, the way you can forgive is make a choice every single day and you say, okay, universe, I choose to forgive so-and-so for what they did to me. Um, I, as an act of obedience and faith in all good things, to clear my heart, clear my mind, release them, release me. I choose to forgive and name the person, name the event, name the occurrence. Choose to forgive every single day. It It's not a feeling. It's not like, wow, you know, I don't feel like forgiving them or I don't feel like they're forgiven. It, it is not a feeling. Forgiveness is not a feeling. It's a, it's a choice. Uh, you have to forgive them though, because you have to move on. And who are you to hold anybody accountable for any behaviors whatsoever? You want to tell me, well, you don't understand what they did. I don't need to understand. I don't need to know what occurred. It doesn't really matter. If they killed your puppy, yeah, be hurt, be upset, but you cannot not forgive. They are not beholden to come to you and apologize. You're going to sit and wait for an apology that will never happen. Um, I don't care what the offense is. It doesn't matter. The bottom line is it is your duty, your job in life, to free your heart, free your mind, release all the resentment, bitterness, anger, and walk free. Don't relive it. Don't rehearse it. Don't rehash it. Don't sit and say, yeah, well, you don't understand. Yeah, but I let it go. What you need to do is be grateful. Be grateful for all the good and positive people in your life. Be grateful for life. Be grateful for breath. Be grateful for everything. Roof over your head. Be grateful because that unforgiveness is holding a placeholder in your heart and it's preventing the good from flowing. The bitterness, the hurt, the resentment, the anger, all of that is stopping your flow right then and there. It's like a clogged toilet. You need to flush it. Flush that toilet. Get that bitterness and anger and resentment out of your heart. It is not your place to judge. It isn't your place to hold somebody beholden. You want to be forgiven. You should be forgiven to other people. Extend that grace. It's a it's a part of walking in light and love and harmony with the universe and attracting those good things that you need and want. You have no room in your life for unforgiveness. Have a happy Easter.